Love Island, known for its tranquil waters and beautiful beaches, is now back with a bang! This is gonna be the most explosive season yet! Two beautiful girls begin their journey looking for love. Meet little Kelly and little Carly. They will be joined by ten guys on Love Island. Little do the girls know that five of the guys are guys they already know from their life. Like I said, most explosive season yet. But for now, let's get to know some of the contestants. Meet Charlie. So, Charlie, what brings you to Love Island? To be honest with you, I don't know. I haven't had much luck with girls over the past few years. I really don't talk to many ladies, to be honest. A apart from my mom, my friends actually signed me up for this show. I, I didn't have anything to do with it. Oh, okay, well that's okay too, Charlie. We can find you somebody on Love Island. So, uh, what do you get up to in your free time? Uh, I spend a lot of time with my dog. I, I like to read, study, and watch movies. I'm hoping to be a teacher eventually, so I really work hard for that. So, when I get there, do I have to talk to girls? Because I, I get really nervous. Yes, Charlie, you'll be going on some dates, but don't worry. You look like a catch to us. We wish you the best of luck with Love Island. Uh, okay, uh, thanks. Meet Chuck. I'm Chuck, the hottest guy that Love Island has ever seen. I've got the body, I've got the personality, and as you can tell, I've got the looks. The only problem I'm gonna have on Love Island is trying to make sure there's enough of me to go around for all the babes. I'm always going on dates, usually four or five a week, and I have the best chat up lines in the world. We know you're a very confident guy indeed, Chuck. Could you share one of your chat up lines with us, please? Okay, well a personal favorite of mine is Girl, are you a parking ticket? Cause you've got fine written all over you. <laughs> Chuck, has that really ever worked for you? Yeah, it has worked, man. What would you know about chicks anyway? Meet Jake. All right, I'm Jake. A lot of you guys don't know me, but you will soon. I'm gonna be a famous actor. I've had some uncredited roles in some huge movies and I've done some modeling too. I'm gonna win the cash from this show, get spotted by an agent and make it to Hollywood. And maybe even pick up a hot chick along the way. There's only gonna be one winner and that's me. It's great to see somebody with a plan, Jake. We didn't know you'd been in some movies. What movies were they? Oh, well, I can't go name dropping, but the movies were pretty big. That doesn't sound suspect at all. What companies have you modeled for? Uh, like I said, I don't wanna go name dropping. Hmm, well, thanks for your time, Jake. Uh, thanks. You might recognize Reuben. Hey, it's Reuben. Not like I need an introduction. I'm sure you know me from my films like Sticky Fingers and The Ruler, and my 10 million followers on Instagram. I'm going to Love Island because I'm tired of model actresses and celebrities using me to make themselves famous. I'm gonna find a normal girl who like me for who I am. So, Ruben, we understand your agent booked you on this show because of your performance in the box office flop Aquaman and that you're trying to win over the public again. I said I wasn't going to answer any questions about that movie! Meet Zeke. So yeah, dude, Love Island. I heard they rad waves out here, dude. And I'm a surfer, so I signed up to the show to see some gnarly surf, dude. I've even brought a new board. It's gonna be rad, man. So, Zeke, you do realize the purpose of this show is to find love? Huh? The purpose of Love Island is to meet other singles and see if you're compatible with them and maybe even fall in love. Oh, well, dude, I just can't wait to surf. Thanks, Zeke. Right on, dude. So now that you've met some of our contestants, let's get down to business. Welcome to Love Island, boys. I bet you're all excited to meet the girls you might fall in love with. Girls, come on down. Yeah. 
you guys all look a little shocked, and I'm not surprised. On this season of Love Island, we're doing something we haven't done before. There'll be people on the island that you know, past relationships, friendships, whatever. And you'll still have to fight for the love of little Kelly and little Carly if you want to win that prize money. You'll have to face challenges to win dates and get some alone time with the girls. Guys, go check out the villa, pick your bedroom, and enjoy yourselves. Oh, little Kelly, look who's here. What are they doing? Guys, did you know we were signing up for this show and all decide to come just to annoy us? Um, no, I had no idea. I mean, little Allie left me, so I thought it'd be a good idea to come on here, but everybody's here. Donnie, you're here too. It, that's it. I'm leaving this place. I've got my ex-girlfriend and her sister here. Where's all the girls? I thought it was supposed yeah, to be all the girls I got, here. I got that too. I've got that too. Hey, can, has, yeah, nobody said how ripped and cool. Oh, look. Uh, uh, your nipples. Your nipples are like a funny color. They're a little bit pink. Okay. Oh gosh, we're yep. being so rude. Um. Oh, sorry, other guys. Uh. Oh gosh, I can't even remember their names. I'm so shocked. Ruben. But uh, Ruben and, and Zeke and Charlie and Chuck and uh, Jake. Jake. Yeah. It's really nice to meet all of you. It's just me and Carly actually know five of the guys that are here. There's Ropo, Raven, Donnie, Leo, and Scuba yeah. Steve. Uh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Where's all the chicks? No, no, no. Did you not read here. the show description? You guys are trying to win the hearts of me and Carly. Yay! What do you mean? What? What do you mean? I thought I've already won your heart over. Uh, what? well, you see, I didn't really think you'd know that I yeah. came on I'm the show. I'm here now, Raven, so... Okay, guys, now. pipe down, pipe down. Everybody's talking over each other, and no one seems to get a word in. Isn't that right, Leo? Oh, uh, it sure is. It sure is, Caddy. Okay, okay, so, uh, what are we going to do? Well, um, the presenter chick said that we should probably go check out the villa, so why don't we start heading up there? Okay, no, it sounds like a okay. plan. Um, so Shop what about the these new bedroom? guys? Uh, Shop on the best bedroom? What? You can't pick the best bedroom, yeah. Donnie. Shop oh, no. I'm sharing with uh, Kelly. I'm getting there first. No, 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 no. <laughs> hey, uh, Scuba Steve, win. how are you? It's been a while. It has been a while. Surprise, surprise Awkward. to see you here, I must say. Uh, uh, I mean, you know, why would you come here for a hamburger Whoa. with a steak at home? Look at this, this place. Man. It's so cool. <laughs> Oh, Whoa. yes, it's got an amazing kitchen. Okay, who's Love impressed it. by good cooking? Because I cook the meanest chicken nugget in town. Oh, you <laughs> do, do you? That's that's really cool. I like uh, a guy who can hold, cook. Hold up, hold up a second. Has anybody checked? I thought we were all gonna have our bedroom, our own bedrooms. Is this like a communal bedroom? Okay, the, the new Where guys are, are jumping on the tables and stuff. I think they're a bit disrespectful. What do they're you think, excited. girls? There's like a big bedroom oh, for boys up here, is it? Okay, I want this bedroom. Uh, uh, no, Carly, I think bed. we're in a Ooh. separate one. This is the boys' one. Let me see. Maybe across the hall. Um, I'll just go stay with the girls. Come on, little Kelly. Me and you can stay in this one. Uh, everyone else you can stay outside. Hey, <laughs> Kevin, I think you need to let go a little Kelly. Uh, guys, why is there five beds and only two girls? What's going on? Oh, there could be more girls coming. Oh, thank oh, awesome. goodness. Woohoo! Rocco, no, that's not very nice. We're oh, your friends. Oh, no, I mean, uh, yeah, you, you guys are awesome. And, um, hey, little Carly, what, what's up? Yeah, you're, maybe you're, you could look at us hey. in a different light now, huh? Yeah, you're looking you're looking good. I, li I like your fingernails. They're, they're pretty pretty awesome. Uh, okay, guys, um, I'm kind of like just a little bit shocked about this whole thing. So uh, maybe me and you, little Cardi, can just go off and have a little chat about all of this real quick. And you guys can have a little bit of more exploring around the villa. Scoop Steve, over here. Come on. We got to talk. Okay. okay. Okay, bye, guys. Come on, little Kelly. Let's yeah, wander around. Donnie, little Donnie, I want to talk to you for a sec. I can't believe it. We just got to the island and no one told us that they were going to invite five guys that we already knew. And two of them were like past boyfriends of mine. And then, I mean, there's Scuba Steve and Ropo. And then there was a whole rumor about me and Ropo when him and Ali were together. And, oh, I don't know. Like, it's all kind of crazy. And I just can't believe they're here. I came to Love Island to get a fresh start. And I really hope that the public can see that. And that I'm not here to, like, stir anything. I'm here for love and love only. And, of course, the prize money would be great. But I'm here to find true love. And I just don't know if I'm going to find it with these guys. They're all guys that I've grown up with and known for so long. And I just can't believe it. And I can't believe that they're all here for the whole time unless they get voted off. And... I don't know if the public is going to have a vote to put me with anyone, but I'd be really interested to see what they see on everyone else's videos to know what they think is going on. It's hard for me to know who's genuine or not when everyone's being nice to my face. Don't you think 
this is all a little bit bizarre. I mean, I just can't believe it, Carly. We came here to meet new guys and have a really good couple of weeks in the sun, and now uh, they we're stuck in a villa with my ex-boyfriend, the guy I'm kind of seeing, your boyfriend, like your ex-boyfriend as well. It's all so much drama, but the new guys are kind of cute, right? Yeah, they are kind of cute, and I didn't know Ropo worked out. I know, he looks super buff, and he said he can cook. I mean, I'm thinking that this will kind of make us see everyone in a different light a little bit. Yeah, me too, but I wonder what we're going to do tonight, though. Oh, maybe we should all get into, like, really nice clothes, and we can sit by the pool and try to get to know everyone a little bit Ooh. better. Well, that's a great idea. I mean, we probably haven't looked at these guys in, like, that kind of light. Well, not, like, all of them. Yeah, exactly. And I think maybe, uh, you see, I've watched Love Island before. So I think after, like, the first week, they ask us to, like, go on a date with one. And we have to pick one out of the whole bunch. Oh, my God. Only one? Yeah, I know. And how hard will be that, like, to decide? Because I don't want to insult Donnie or Raven or anything. But one of the new guys might be really nice. And how about you? Are you willing to, like, date other people in front of Leo? Well, I mean, it's a game show. Do you know what I mean? He obviously came on as well, not expecting me to be here. Ooh, that's true, actually. Oh, you've got some stuff to talk about, girl. Yes, definitely. Well, well we should have a little creep around and see if we can hear what these guys are saying. Yeah, I mean, I want, kind of want to check out the villa a little bit <gasps> more. <gasps> Who's there? Look, these three. Oh, the, these two are, like, un inseparable. Look at them. I know. Leo and Raven, like, I feel like Leo needs to just break away from Raven a little bit so he can find himself, you know? Oh, look, there's other people over there as well. Oh, I can see who's talking. Uh, Ropo and Scoop of Steve. Donnie seems to be the boss, doesn't he? He seems I, to... Yeah, he bosses them all around. It's it's a little bit strange. Well, where are all the new guys? They're probably so freaked out because we know everyone in here already. Probably, but come on, let's continue to spy. Oh, Scoop of Steve's nipples are awful. They, they're quite pink. Yeah, they're, they're like luminescent. Maybe he has like a weird reaction to the sun. I wonder what he's saying to do Ropo. Do you think he's talking about you? I mean, you are his ex-girlfriend. Oh, gosh, I don't know, but I kind of think Ropo's kind of cute. Oh, no way. That's so fun. Oh, my gosh. Okay, have they gone into... They went into the diary room. Okay, ah! okay, let's run, let's run, let's run. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, oh, gosh. We can't. They can't think that we're listening in on them. No, okay, well, what do you want to do now? Um, well, maybe we should go and unpack some more of our stuff and then uh, we can go and maybe try and just see about tonight and ask what everyone wants to do or who wants to cook or whatever. Good idea. Now, look, I'm them spying out at Donnie over here. Come join me. I'm <gasps> in the kitchen. Oh, yeah, look at them. He looks really nice in that light. Oh, oh, we've oh, been caught. Ah, get out of here. Oh, my gosh, we've been caught again. Okay, okay, okay. Well, look, uh, let's try and get the group back together or maybe we, you know what we should do? We should split up and try to get to know the guys a little bit more. Take a couple of them each and then we'll have a little chat and see, you know, maybe who we want to cozy up to tonight when we're out at the fire pit. Good idea. I can't believe how chill Cardi is being about the fact that Leo's here. I mean, they're actually in a relationship right now, and she signed up to another island? It's kind of crazy. Dude, dude, there's Kelly. She's talking to the new guys. Oh my gosh, that's so interesting, Charlie. I can't believe that. That's such a cool job that you have. And oh my gosh, Wait. Chuck, I mean, Girl, you look this. so buff. You must work out hey, all the... Hey, oh. hey, what's up, guys? Hey, hey oh. newbie one and newbie two. You must be Shook and you must be... Uh, which one? Uh, no, oh uh, yeah. Guys, I mean, be nice. Oh. This is Charlie and this is Chuck. And uh, they're a little bit nervous about all you guys coming into the villa. Yeah, Aww. no worries. Hey, what's <laughs> up? Um, so this one, okay, the one, the guy with the blue hat is Charlie, right? No, the dad's Chuck. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I just forgot really quickly there. Uh, so Chuck, what's up? I'm a superhero. <laughs> just so I'd let you know. Um, Kelly, what's going on? Um, um, this place is pretty fun. No, well, like I kind of just want to hear, like, let's just sit down together or something, cause I, you guys sit down, because I kind of, you know, I got to know Chuck and uh, Charlie there a little bit and about their reasons for being on the island and everything. But you know, if we're gonna play this game show seriously, I need to know what your guys' motives are here. Are you here looking for? love or are you here looking for the money or just to have a good time like a uh, ropo what do you think um well you know me little kelly i'm all about the love i've got my heart absolutely smashed into a million pieces by little ally she left me she left youtube she just she just got up and left can you actually believe that so i am here to find my true love and just my soulmate 
Oh, wow. Oh, okay. That's like way deeper than I've heard ever heard you talk before, Ropo. I'm really seeing a different mm -hmm. side to you. Yep. And Scuba Steve, how about you? Well, see, I thought I already had my soulmate, but didn't really work out between me and little Carly. So it's kind of awkward that she's here, but I don't know. Maybe I know Leo's here too, but I don't know. Hey, maybe we could get to talking. I mean, we haven't really hung out in a long time, so maybe... Maybe, I don't know. Well, oh, there are other girls coming in, so I kind of want to keep my options open. But um, why I'm here... Uh, oh, you're you're definitely kinda... not here for the money, man. That That's all we know. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, it's kind of some personal reasons, too. But I don't really want to get into that just yet. Oh, oh it's only the first okay. Day. So you're kind of, like, hoping to rekindle your romance with Carly, but, I mean, I know there's definitely other guys here that have caught her eye as well, so... I mean, uh, what about you, little Kelly? I mean, you yeah. just had like a breakup with Donnie a while ago, and uh, mm. I saw the way that uh, that Zeke guy was looking at you. But mm, I don't know. What do you? What do? You, what are you here for? Um. Well, you see, me and Raven have come and kind of been on and off and on and off, and me and Donnie were obviously finished. And I don't know. I just thought it'd be a lot of fun to come and get away from normal life for a while and just have like a like nice socializing, go on a few dates, see if I can find some love, and hopefully find my perfect match and win the prize money yes sounds good but i just want to let you know that that zeke guy oh man you want to hear what he said about you earlier on wait Ooh. wait what do you mean what he oh, said no, about no, me no, 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 nothing nothing no no sorry i should no the game hasn't even started yet i shouldn't have opened my mouth uh, guys come on let's see what everyone else is up to come on let's go uh, I don't know what to say. I mean, Ropo and Scuba Steve are being so nice. And as I was trying to get to know the other guys on the island, I don't know. Uh, things got a little bit weird. Ropo started talking about that Zeke guy as if uh, as if he was talking badly about me. I mean, I don't even know the guy. And I haven't really even had a proper conversation with him. But I'm not going to take Ropo's word for it. Because he might have just like taken it up wrong. And maybe Zeke just has good intentions. But it's hard to know who to trust here. I really wish I could see other people's diary room entries. <laughs> if only. But that's where I'm going to need the public to help. They're going to have to like vote me to get with guys that are really, really nice if that time comes up and who aren't trying to steer me wrong or aren't just here for the money like i said i'm here for true love and anyone who's here only for the money and just to abuse me and little cardi and use us and drop us afterwards after they win the prize money it's not okay with me and yeah and then little cardi said that but uh, little cardi hi Oh, oh, hey, little Kelly, I, I, I saved the sea here for you. Oh, thanks, guys. Oh, it's so nice that you guys are talking to the new guys. Hi, Zeke, Ruben, and uh, Jake, right? Uh, sorry I haven't really got to speak to you much. It's been kind of crazy. Um, I was just speaking to Ropo and uh, Scuba Steve outside, and they're acting so nice. It's kind of crazy. Yeah, little Kelly, I'd be careful of that Ropo fella, though. He's a bit weird. I mean, he often says lots of really bad things about you behind your back. Wait, yeah. what? Yeah, yeah. We, uh, we, we heard it. He was just like, he was like, oh, we're, I'm here for a little Kelly, but I'm going to try play little Kelly first. So we were just like, oh, my gosh, we had to tell little Kelly. So I'm sorry, little Kelly, but Ropo's not interested in you. That's so it's weird. True, I it's mean, true. It's, uh, like, Leo, wait, did you hear this, too? Yeah, I was with the guys. We were like hanging out by the pool and then Ropo just came up like bragging, being all like and Scoop. Steve was like, yeah, it's going to be great. It's going to be so funny. Watch this. I was just like. Guys, we gotta tell little Kelly straight away. And then yeah, Raven and little was... Kelly, make sure you tell little Kelly that Scuba Steve was talking about her behind her back as well. Uh, okay. I mean, this is all very really weird. I, I just don't understand why everyone can't act normal. But look, Raven, Donnie, I didn't mean to insult you by coming on this show. By the way, I just came on to get like a bit of a fresh start and get away from all the drama for a while and just have like a nice fun holiday and maybe find love. And I definitely want to find my perfect match and win the prize money. Yeah, well, Ooh, little, well, me and little Donnie are gonna fight for your love, little uh, Kelly, because we have no interest in anybody else. But it's gonna, we're gonna just show you exactly who you want to be with by the end of it, and then we can live happily ever after. And Donnie can be our butler. Uh, that's kind of <laughs> crazy. Excuse me, I'm not a butler, I'm a prince. See, the thing is, little Kelly, those three are princes, and we all have lots of money, so we're not here for the money. But Ropo and Scuba Steve are here for the money. That's all they want. They don't want to fall in love. They don't want nice girls. They just want to get the money. That's why they're saying such bad things behind your back all the time. Oh, gosh, okay. But, Leo, what's what's your take on it? I mean, are you are you here to rekindle, like, kind of, well, spark your romance with little Cardi some more? Are you here to make her jealous? I mean, uh, I just don't, I don't really get why you're here. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, well, sort of like Raven said about going on. And then I was like, you know what? I'm going to go on it with you, dude. The two of us will go on. And then I just, when I got here, I saw a little Carly. And I was sort of like, uh, what? And then 
was talking to her down there at the beach, and she's already talking about how good Ropo looked and stuff, so she must have moved on pretty quickly. Okay, so Ropo's saying he's here for Cardi, and Cardi has a crush on Ropo, which that's definitely one of the relationships we're going to have to watch and see what happens with. But guys, like, honestly, I really, like, I'm just so excited for the challenges to start, and then we can have some fun and, you know, start going on some dates. And I just want to see you all, you guys, in a different light, and, you know, it's just being different when you're put into a villa away from everyone else and then you're put on an island and especially with these new guys as well I want to see how you get on with them and how you interact with new people and if you're nice and I'm going to be keeping an eye on you guys <laughs> okay perfect little Kelly but um if you're not doing anything later, um, I've kind of like set up like a little private dinner down by the beach. If no, you're that's cheating. That's cheating. Um, you can't go off and have different dates on your own. No, 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 no. Time. It's that's for the competitions. But me and little Cardi were thinking earlier, maybe since it's the first night, uh, we could all, you know, just put on some nice clothes later on during sunset and all sit around and be together. Yeah, that's an awesome idea. We could all get dressed up and go and have a really cool beach party. Yeah, definitely. I'm okay, down for that. well, guys, I better go and find little Cardi, but thanks for letting me know about people talking behind my back. Like, I really, really appreciate it. And you guys are really good friends and maybe possible, like, my true love. But I'm just going to go up to my room and see if little Cardi's up there. I'll talk to you guys later. Hey, see, you later. Bye. see you, little Cardi. Ugh, now I really don't know what to believe. I was talking to Donnie and Raven and Leo in the kitchen, along with Zeke, Ruben and Jake. I think that's their names. Gosh, it's so hard to get to know the new guys when all the guys I already know are coming in. But they started telling me that Ropo and Scuba Steve, like Ropo has a big game that he's playing and he doesn't even want to get to know me in the romantic sense. And it's not like me and Ropo have ever been romantic. But I mean, it's just kind of strange that they, they're my friends and they're talking badly about me behind my back and you know i trust donnie we had a good relationship in the past i know we've broken up now but i want to believe what he's saying and the same with leo and raven i mean raven and i live in the same castle for goodness sake i can't believe he's here on the island and leo is always such a genuine guy but if scuba steve and ropo are playing a serious game i'm gonna have to keep my eye out for them there you are little kelly why are you by yourself oh i just couldn't find you earlier on and I don't know, I just heard some really weird things that kind of upset me and I needed to just get away from the villa for Why? a bit. Why are you upset for? Well, you see, I was hanging out with Ropo and Scuba Steve and they told me that Zeke was like talking total smack about me, saying that I was ugly and stuff. And then when I was with Donnie, Raven and Leo, they were saying that Ropo and Scuba Steve were saying horrible stuff, saying that they're just here for the money and that like that Ropo has a crush on you, but he's going to try play me as well, just in case you don't like Ropo and all these crazy things. Yes, well, I heard that Chuck said that I wasn't, uh, that he thought I was ugly, but little Kelly, Donnie likes boys. Wait, what? Yeah, that's what we found out. He was totally eyeing up Ruben, and Ruben was eyeing him up back, and then he got all of ours, and we said, hey, Donnie, it's the 21st century. Oh my gosh, totally, and you know, like, some people like boys and girls, and that's totally okay, and I mean, uh, this island's all about finding true love, so who knows what could happen? Yeah, I know, so bizarre, but definitely uh, Ropo is looking very well. Ooh, really? You, you have your eye on Ropo? I mean, he is looking very well, right? Yeah, I mean, I, I did ask Leo for you why he came on the island because I knew that you were kind of like a little bit confused because you guys were kind of seeing each other or whatever. But he said that, you know, Raven was coming on and he just kind of wanted to come on for the fun of it. And he said that he was shocked to see you and he knew you were shocked to see him too. And I mean, are you going to have a chat about it like later uh on? I don't know, maybe. You know what? Maybe he's into Raven. He All he does is sp spend time with him. That is so true as well. And I wonder what all of them are up there talking about now. I mean, I haven't really got a chance to talk to the new guys, though. No, me neither. Well, we'll be going to try and find some of them. Yeah, I mean, why not? But this villa and this island is so cool, little Cardi. I'm so glad that we auditioned and we both got on. I know, it's so exciting. We're going to have the best couple of weeks. I know, and I just really want everyone to just get along with each other, and I don't know, because it seems like they're already backstabbing each other, I really, I mean, it's the first day. I know it is, it's all drama, 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 but it'll be super fun. Yeah, exactly, um, oh my gosh, I still don't know what I'm gonna wear tonight, though, for the little sunset gathering that we're gonna have with everyone, but it'll be nice to have everyone together. Yeah, and the water's so clear, look how blue it is. I know, oh, do you wanna jump in the pool for a bit, and then we can go up and shower and get ready? 
Yeah, definitely. Oh my gosh, it's so hot out here. Oh, there are those boys who are saying mean things about me. Oh gosh, and look, there's Chuck and... Yeah, Chuck and Charlie, I think their names are. Oh, Why look. is Leo in his normal clothes? I don't know, he must have got changed. Weird. Very odd. Okay, well, let's have a little quick dip and then we can Ooh, go and get ready. Yeah. Ooh. Okay, I am so confused after the conversation I had with little Carly on the beach. I mean, she told me that Donnie has a crush on a boy in here. And I mean, that's totally awesome and everything. But I just didn't know he liked boys too. Uh, I mean, each is to their own. And we're all on Love Island to find love. And they're meant to be competing for me and Carly. But if they find love elsewhere, I'm so okay with that. I am a little confused though. There are more beds in me and Carly's room. Which does make me think that there's going to be other girls on this island. Island, which is kind of intimidating because I haven't even got a chance to know all of the guys yet, especially the new guys. And I just can't believe this. I'm already finding out new stuff about Donnie and about Ropo and Scuba Steve and everything. And it's all a little bit too much for me right now. I mean, Donnie was my boyfriend for ages and he never mentioned that he likes boys too. But then again, I didn't hear it from Donnie. So you can't believe anything you hear on this island. Oh man, it's been a great first day, but where is Scuba Steve? We're waiting on him so we can close out the show. I uh, know. Guys, there's a stranger over there in, in the bushes. Someone's creeping around over there. Where? What? Over there in the tree. Look, there's someone over there. Look, Scuba Steve, creep. come on. It's, it's, it's me, but look, um, I kind of, you can't laugh, okay? Because I, I packed the wrong oh. suitcase. This is my, uh, Scuba Come Steve. over here. <laughs> 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 Look, he's he's oh my gosh, what are you wearing? He I'm looks like cave, Fred man. Flintstone. I'm a caveman, okay? I forgot my forgot all my clothes. Like, this is my joke shop uh, costume suitcase Aww, that I brought on. You look really cute, though. <laughs> you look like yeah, a but I don't want to be saying that. You're sitting next to Ruben Paul. Calm down. Right, <laughs> Where's my seat? Oh, man. You okay, can sit um, anywhere, Scuba Steve. Right. It's been a great day. Oh, little Carly here. I, I brought you something. Here's that uh, marshmallow on a stick. You can roast Ooh. it in the fire. It's, it's super cute. Thank Ropa you, Robo. Oh, nice. he's, he's, he's probably going to charge you for it. I need you some. Probably. Did you toast it? Oh, yeah. It, my... It's nice and toasted. Thanks so much. You're very sweet. Nice. Woo. Good first day, guys. Good first day. This was so much fun. Oh, look at Ruben and Donnie sitting in a tree. <laughs> what is everyone oh, talking oh, about? Looking Literally. good, guys. <laughs> okay, guys, well, we should probably get a good night's rest because we got to do all of this again tomorrow. And I heard that there might be a challenge day by one of the crew people. So that means that everyone will be fighting to get a date with me or Carly. Oh, Ooh. That's, that's, that's sweet. I'm so going to win that. 